Getting a visa refusal can be a devastating result to many applicants who are looking forward to making the move to the United States and who have put all of their effort into their visa application. Because immigration laws are strict and visa applications can be competitive, getting a visa refusal happens often, but it doesn't mean you need to give up on your immigration goals. When receiving a visa refusal, first, it's important to determine why your application was turned down and what you need to address before attempting to reapply for a U.S. visa. A visa refusal letter is the denial of a non-immigrant visa application to the U.S. A refusal letter and a denial are used interchangeably but differ from a visa rejection. There are several reasons that you might receive a visa refusal letter and the letter should give you a reason why. Let's talk about some of the common reasons why your U.S. visa could be refused. There are two different types of refusals. First is the 221G refusal, which is the result of missing documentation or information on your visa application. This refusal letter will be color-coded. Blue means additional supporting documents are needed. White means further processing is needed. Pink means additional processing is being undertaken to check the validity of the provided information. And yellow means that longer time is needed to determine the status of the applicant. In order to fight this type of refusal, you must follow the directions on the specific colored form that you received back. This might involve providing more documentation or simply waiting for additional processing to be completed. Next is the 214B refusal. This type of visa refusal letter is the result of not convincing the immigration officer that you will be returning to your home country, that you have the sufficient funds to complete the trip, and or that you will be undertaking appropriate travel as designated by the visa application. This type of refusal is not permanent and can be mitigated if the applicant provides more evidence that demonstrates the ties to another country outside of the U.S. Your immigration interview is an important aspect and can help you demonstrate that you plan on leaving the U.S. after your visit. However, there are some cases in which an individual will not qualify until they experience a change of circumstances in their home country. If you have received a visa refusal letter, it's important to receive help from an immigration professional to ensure that your revised application is in perfect shape before resubmitting. Getting one of these refusal letters does not mean it's the end of the road and we want to help you reach your immigration goals. Book a consultation to speak with a professional at Visa Place to get started. To stay updated and learn more about visa refusals, denials, and how to recover, you can subscribe to our YouTube channel or read our informational blog at visaplace.com. We can't wait to work with you.